Welcome, Hoosier fans, to today's edition of Banner Morning, your daily rundown of IU basketball news and notes. I'm Dylan Wallace, and let's reflect on Indiana's win over North Alabama. Indiana's 26-point victory Tuesday night didn't come in the prettiest of ways, but nonetheless it has the Hoosiers at 3-0 on the season. Trace Jackson Davis led the way for IU in the game, scoring a new career high of 20 points. The freshman only made three field goals, so you might be wondering how it's possible he got up to 20. It's because he made 14 free throws in 15 attempts. That's an impressive feat for a freshman, let alone one that doesn't have much of a jump shot. Jackson Davis said he has altered his free throw motion a bit, holding the ball higher from the start rather than lower because it allows less room for error on the release. He admitted Tuesday night that it was the best he's ever shot from the charity stripe, and his season total is now at 17 for 21. Indiana as a team is 76% from the line. Jackson Davis also continued to impress on the defensive end, finishing the game with three blocks. Through three games, Jackson Davis is averaging three blocks per game, which has him on pace to finish with 93, which would be tied for the second most all-time in a single season in program history with Dean Garrett, who did it in 1986-87. Garrett also holds the record for blocks in a single season with 99, which he did in 1987-88. Despite Jackson Davis playing good individual defense, as a team, Indiana continues to struggle. They allowed North Alabama to shoot 7 from 10 from the three-point line after poor rotations and poor closeouts. According to Ken Palm, the Lions came into the game ranked 339th in three-point shooting. The Lions' hot shooting kept them in the game in the first half, and Indiana only took a seven-point lead into halftime. They cleaned things up in the second half, allowing zero three-pointers and holding North Alabama to just five total field goals in the game's final 20 minutes. The Hoosiers finally broke open the scoreboard en route to its 91-65 victory. Joining Jackson Davis in double figures was Rob Fennessy with 13 points, Jerome Hunter with 12, Al Durham with 11, and Demise Anderson with 10. It's a balanced scoring attack that follows Archie Miller's score-by-committee mantra, which Indiana will need game in and game out if they want to keep getting victories, especially with Devontae Green's absence. While no update on Green's return, Miller did make it seem like he's getting closer to returning to the court. For the links mentioned in this edition of Banner Morning, visit assemblycall.com. Remember to use the URL iutickets.shop to visit SeatGeek for the best prices on IU basketball tickets. That's iutickets.shop, promo code assembly, for $10 off your first purchase. We'll be back tomorrow with a new edition of Banner Morning. Until then, keep your elbows in, your eyes on the rim, and go Hoosiers.